Ladies and gentlemen, please strap yourselves down and get ready to meet I'm Dave. Young Master Dave. He's a real whiz kid. Hop down to the shop and get yourself some. This should be enough. And young Miss Molly. She's cute. You want to get out more? Thank your puff. She's cool. Nothing. She's got a kick like a mule. Then there's Mr. Stephen, master magician. Is that your card? No. Entertainer extraordinaire. Please don't clap. Oh, all right, oh. he's rubbish, but he's cheap. Boy. And, of course, the star of the show. It's the one and only... Oh, what's his name again? Oh, it begins with a B. Is it, is it the Barry? Hey, watch it. No, no, it's Boris. There should be every word with your agent later. It's Basil. Basil Brush! This week, like the smell of old socks, romance is in the air. No. Roses are red, violets are blue. And hey, young Mr. Dave, what's going on here then? Are you writing me a love letter? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's my new sideline writing poems and greetings cards. Oh, I like poetry. Oh, come on, let's hear one. <laughs> come on, come on. <laughs> All right. Mm. But I haven't quite cracked it yet. Never mind, I won't laugh. <laughs> Carry on, young Wordsworth. To my darling wife. <laughs> you said you wouldn't laugh. Sorry, <laughs> merely a titter. <laughs> Carry on. We've been together ages. Our love it is so strong. I always look at you and think. Blimey, where did I go wrong? <laughs> <laughs> where did I go? Hey, hey, visit it. I'm sorry, Dave. Uh, read me another one. <laughs> I promise I'll be serious. Promise, 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 promise. <laughs> Well, OK. Yeah. <clears throat> this one's for a Get Well Soon card. Oh! <laughs> I'm sorry you were poorly. And I hope that you get well. So wrap yourself up warmly. And wash your feet, they smell like... <laughs> <laughs> bom, bom, wash your feet, they smell, they bong. <laughs> hey, Dave, where are you going? I'm sorry, I was only trying to help. <laughs> Discovered a spiky gorilla. I'm a hedgehog. Of course you are, Mr. <laughs> I'm teaching children to cross the street a snuff with the road safety hedgehog. This is my costume. That's a relief. I thought you'd put in too much hair gel. I don't have time for this. I've got to get down to the school. I'm running late. Oh, which one? St Nigel's. Cool! The rough one. <laughs> you know, it's so rough at that school, the teachers have to get their parents to pick them up. <laughs> oh, look at the time. I haven't even had any breakfast. Ah, do you want a bowl of milk with some bread in it? <laughs> <laughs> no. He's a bit prickly this morning. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Morning, Miss Molly. What you got there, Mom? Postcard from Mum and Dad. They've reached him a laser, apparently. Ah, uh, Molly, at least one person who won't take the mickey. <laughs> well, I ever said what a great role model you are, Uncle Stephen. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Miss Molly. It isn't easy for Mr. Stephen trying to earn a crust as the professional magician he so longs to be. <laughs> <laughs> Just remind you of what your mum and dad said before they went off gallivanting round the world. Right. While we're off gallivanting round the world, <laughs> your Uncle Stephen's in charge. I know he's a complete burke, but apparently on his passport it says that he's an adult, so you do what he tells you, right? Come on, Mum. Let's get gone. <sighs> Ta -ta. You heard. I'm a responsible adult, OK? <laughs> anyway, I'd love to stay and shout at you. But I've got to go to work. Yes, as a human pincushion. <laughs> <laughs> Later that day at Arnold's Cafe. Oh, oh that rhymes. Oh, heavens above. Oi, service, where are our drinks? Hold on a minute. 
What do you think of my new posh menus? Uh, just like they have in the posh restaurants. Uh, but Anil, we're not in a posh restaurant. I've seen posh burger well. <laughs> That's why I'm having a revamp. I'm going up market. Woo! To buy vegetables. <laughs> no, up market, not up the market. Tonight is my grand opening. The local newspaper sending their restaurant critic. Yeah. These new menus, Gordon Blur. Gordon Bennett, more like. Have you seen these prices? <laughs> Blimey, what a cheek. <laughs> Three cups of tea, please, Mush. I'll bring them over to you. Great <laughs> kids! Great Scott! It's Frankenstein's Hedgehog. Uh, hey, what happened to you? Class 3F happened. They were everywhere. It was... It was horrible. Just in time, a large, hot, steaming mug of... I see. What do you call that? Three teas. Eh? Hey, have I grown or have those cups shrunk? This hey. is how they serve it in the fancy restaurants. That'll be six pounds, please. Six pounds? <laughs> hey, but you couldn't drown an ant in that. <laughs> it's all part of the move up market. Smaller portions, bigger prices. Ah, very well. Pay the man, Mr. Stephen. I left my wallet in my other animal costume. Molly? Dave, can you change your 50? Oh, yeah. Then you got loads of money. I don't know what you're wearing about a measly six pounds. <laughs> uh, he got you there, Mr. Anno. <laughs> well done, Dave. I can't stand around. I've got loads to do to get this place ready. We'll give you a hand, Anno. Oh, great. Will you? What? For nothing? <laughs> ah! <laughs> don't worry, Anno. I'll help you. For free! <laughs> He's looking at a girl again. Pathetic, isn't it? He's got all good. <laughs> Mr. Stephen, step out of it. Focus, man. Focus. Sorry. But she is lovely. Do you mind not doing that while I'm talking to you? But she's smiling at me. Right, I'm off home. Are you sure you're going to be all right here on your own, Basil? Oh, yes. I'm going to wait and see how young Mr. Stephen gets on. <laughs> well, don't cramp his style, Basil. <laughs> <laughs> hello, hello, hello. Well, Mr. Stephen, aren't you going to introduce me to your friend? <laughs> oh, yes, sorry, Basil. This is Amanda. Enchanté, as they say in Germany, if they speak in French. <laughs> Hello, Basil. Oh, she's very nice, isn't she, Miss Stephen? Aren't you well spoken? She went to finishing school. Oh, you can speak Finnish. No. No, uh, that's a shame. I've got a reindeer at home and I can't read the instructions. <laughs> so, uh, did you come here at evening? Often, I haven't seen you around here before. No, it's my first time. I've just moved to the area with work. <laughs> so, what do you do? I dress up as a hedgehog. Ah, oh, well, that'll explain it, then. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Mr Stephen would never dress up like this for fun, you know. Exactly. Yes, for fun, he dresses up as a baboon. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh look at that! Oh, what's that? It's me! Oh, nothing. So, uh, do you... Live round here? Yes. My aunt's putting me up until I can find my own place. I'm supposed to be meeting her here, actually. Oh, great. Oh, we'll stick around and say hello. <laughs> oh, well, I don't think that's such a good idea. You see, um, she's not too good with new people. Nah, she'll be all right with us, you know. I've always been a one with the ladies. <laughs> and when women meet Mr Stephen, they usually want to smother him. Oh, you mean mother him? No, nope, I was right the first time. <laughs> here she is now. Uh, not her. Her. Oh, get out of the way, you old fool! <laughs> Hello, madam. Welcome to Anil's. Talk to the brolly. Hello, brolly. Welcome to Anil's. Hello, aunt. Are you ready to go, Amanda? Oh, can't you wait for a moment? Sit down. Oh, if I must. <laughs> 
There seems to be a hedgehog at the table. Aunt, this is Stephen. Pleased to meet you. <laughs> Perhaps I should explain why I'm dressed no as a... No need. Come along, Amanda. We've really got to get going. Aunt, this is Basil. Always a pleasure to meet a real lady. <laughs> and when one comes along, I'll introduce you to her. <laughs> 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 yeah, the old brush magic -o. Now, come <laughs> along, Amanda. Hurry up. Goodbye. <laughs> Oi, get off. Uh, get off. Oh, <laughs> isn't he gorgeous? <laughs> <laughs> come along, Amanda. <gasps> okay. It was lovely to meet you both. Bye-bye. Mm. <laughs> oh, no. I forgot to get a number. Ah, well, when you think about it, she might grow up to be like her aunt. <laughs> Stephen? <laughs> Would you like to have dinner with me later? Yes. Oh, great. Shall we say here? Here? Seems all right. All right. Can I recommend our new Gordon Bleu menu? Please say yes, the restaurant critics in. It looks fine. Sounds great to me. Shall we say seven? Seven? Oh, well, that's just one thing. My aunt, you see, she's, um... She's on her own, and, um, you wouldn't mind if she came, would you? No! Of course I don't mind. Why don't I bring a friend along for her so she won't feel left out? Oh, that would be lovely. Thank you. Bye. It's all right. I know just the person. <laughs> Oh, go on, Basil. <laughs> no, I'm Basil Brush, not Daft, is he? Oh, go on, Basil, help him out. Stephen never gets a date. Yeah, exactly. I never get a... Oi! But you didn't see the old girl, Miss Molly. Cool, blimey, strike me. The last time I saw a face like that, it had a hook in it. <laughs> go on, Basil, just this once. Will Basil agree to go? Will Stephen win Amanda's heart? Will Young have another hit single? Will Shakespeare used to write plays? Will you shut up? <laughs> and I'll be able to tell him, won't I? Oh, go on, Basil. No, never. Never in a million year, year, years. Year, year, oh, dear. Oh, I say. Oh, it's, oh, it's nice that it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, right, right. oh, thanks, Basil. So, what are you going to wear? Wear? I hadn't thought about clothes. Oh, but you must wear clothes, Mr. Stephen. You'll give her the shock of her life for the world. Come on. Me and Bez will help you choose. You see, Mr. Stephen, your wardrobe doesn't look very epic. It's all your horrible shirts. They've given it indigestion. Wardrobe that eats people? Who silly idea was that? <laughs> At last, my man eating wardrobe has succeeded. And soon, soon I will unleash my occasional table of horror. <laughs> Back at Annals, it's almost time for the grand opening. Need hands, Annal? Yeah, I can't follow this book at all. Let's see. Right. Monkfish Gujons. Okay. What's a good one? I don't know. Have you got any monkfish? Mm, no. What sort of fish have you got? Fingers. Oh, well, I don't suppose anyone will notice if all the other ingredients are right. Potato dauphin yeah, yeah, yeah. You do have potatoes? Yeah, of course I do. I, I mean, technically, they are frozen chips. <laughs> you know, this is no good. How do you expect to impress the restaurant critic if you haven't got the right ingredients? Like this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it was a long shot. Cool. What's that smell? It's my aftershave. Oh, the toilet. Oh dear me, more like. <laughs> oh, look out! Beauty and the Beast have arrived. Hello, Stephen. Hello, Amanda. Uh, 
any trouble getting here? No. Shame. Will you live in hope? Shall we see what's on the menu? Looks like some dried egg to me. Good evening, madame, messieurs. Hey, I think he's talking to some French people. He's talking to us. Yeah, that's a relief. I thought I'd become invisible. Uh, but that would never be a problem for you, will it, love? Uh... I like art. Oh, yes, I like art too. Yes, yes, very good for hanging on walls. Covers up the damp petrols. He means, will we be ordering a la carte? L? Who's L? And why does he need a cart? Uh, hey, how much food are you planning on bringing out here, Mushy? Uh, actually, looking at her, we probably will need a couple of carts. <laughs> <laughs> This is funny. You should see me when I bother to learn the script. Script? What script? Yeah, that's it, my dear. You keep the magic alive. Oh, Basil, you are so cute. Quick, look, it's the Queen. Where? Is that your card? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Amazing. He keeps them up his sleeves, don't you know? <laughs> what are the cards? No! His arms. <laughs> what are you doing over here, Basil? Well, I just wanted to see if you were having a nice time. We're fine. Now, why don't you go back to your own table? Oh, don't make me Mr. Stephen. There's only so much a fox can bear. Back. Oh, all right, then I'll be going. But if anything happens to me, you know, I just want you to know... Basil! That... Yes? Go. Yeah, it's a far, far better thing I do now. Oh, say it, <laughs> You're a very cruel man, Mr. Stephen. <laughs> Today I ordered a prawn cocktail. We don't do prawn cocktails. Well, what's she drinking, then? <laughs> well, you could have hers, but I don't really think she wants to share. Yeah, that's the problem with prawns. Very shellfish. Prawn, <laughs> <laughs> prawn, <bomb>, very shellfish. <laughs> Molly, this has got to be the restaurant critic. Be extra nice to him. Sure. Would you like to see the menu? No, I thought I'd just guess what you're serving. <laughs> the potatoes, are they new? Well, we've had them about a week. Don't be insolent. The soup of the day, what is it? Tuesday. <laughs> just bring me the soup. I need to be afraid. Oh, look at her go! <laughs> there is the time limit, you know. <laughs> so, Basil. Tell me about yourself. He's held it by nails and he's got three books on it. I said yourself, not your shelf. Yeah, I'm sorry. I must have misheard you, Miss Funny Mono. <laughs> How very droll. <laughs> you are the one. Yes, and looking at you, I'd say you were at least an 18. <laughs> You daily bust in my cock. Oh, <laughs> let Auntie kiss you better. Hey, not on your nelly. Mm. Hey, ooh. <laughs> Basil seems to be having fun with your aunt. Yeah, she's not too bad when she loosens up. <laughs> Dave, what are you doing? Oh, how lovely. Do you want to buy a rose? No, I don't. Okay. Let me put that another way. Do you want me to go away? Yes. That'll be one pound then. Or a six for five. Done. You up him, mate. You up him. Service! Service! Right, all right, I'm coming. I've never been kept waiting so long in my life. You are the worst waitress I've ever had the misfortune to come across in all my years of restaurant going. You ought to get out more. Beg your pardon? Nothing. Well, come along, girl, or the soup will be cold. What's the matter with you? Are you stupid? Right, that's it! <laughs> Whoops! Terribly sorry. I hope it wasn't too cold. Molly! What are you doing? You did that on purpose!
worry about. Them. <laughs> <laughs> right, that's it. For me, for yourselves, and the people at home. I think we ruined it for them ages ago. I'm off. Huh? Huh? Hey, don't be like that. No, 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 I heard enough. That's enough. Wh where are you going? Come back. My show. It's ruined. <sighs> Bezel brush off the air. Oh, I'll never work again. <laughs> Goodbye, viewers. Excuse me. What is it, fatty? I could probably operate all of the equipment. I used to do a bit of filming my youth. Really? Oh, now that is a coincidence. <laughs> well done, Righto. You're a restaurant critic and cameraman. No, I'm not a restaurant critic. I am just very rude and overbearing. <laughs> um, I'm the critic from the newspaper. <gasps> you? Yes. I miss that. I, I normally don't skate for the sport. You're going to give us a terrible review, aren't you? Oh, not at all. It's all been quite fun. <laughs> and Aunt had a good time. <laughs> I think I'd better take her home now. Thank you, Stephen, for a lovely evening. It's really nice. That's all all right then, isn't it? <laughs> Who is going to clean up my restaurant? I think Basil should do it. Hmm? It is his show. Good idea. Come on, everyone. Yeah. See you, Basil. Bye, Basil. Hey, hey. <laughs> Oi, it's not fair. Hey. I didn't make a comeback for this, you know. <laughs> the cheek of it. Just because it's my show. I'll have you know I'm not the sort of brush that sweeps up. God, you can't get the stuff. <sighs> oh, well. My mother always said, Basil, play your cards right and you'll clean up in this town. <laughs> clean up. Boom, boom! Hey, not bad going, eh, Mr. Stephen? For the first episode and all that. <laughs> yeah, I remembered all my lines. Not necessarily in the right order. <laughs> I tell you what, though, Mr. Stephen. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad that arm's gone. <laughs> she was a woman and a half. Quite literally. Uh... Yeah, I was frightened for me life. <laughs> hey, Mr. Stephen. <laughs> Mr. Stephen? 